What's going on, everybody? It's Robin here. Thank you for joining me for your daily tarot card reading. This is going to be for Wednesday, February 2nd for the collective, okay? And I will be using the Tattoo Tarot Ink and Intuition, but because we're doing a cat theme week, I'm going to pull one card from the Fantasy Cats Oracle. Um, and Lacey's still giving me weirdo looks here. So this is a pretty incredible card. And it just happened to be, it's a coincidence that I pulled the Dreaming card and the underlying message is your imagination and intuition, okay? And this is called the Tattoo Tarot Ink and Intuition. So I really love the familiar that is front and center here. And the way that it really appears that that character in the card is the moon, but sort of morphed into this deep and inner knowledge, okay? So the moon is quite fantastic when you are trying to manifest things when you are focusing there's different phases of the moon that there's um better things to try to achieve so uh really cool card here um imagination and intuition okay so with your imagination you can achieve anything that you have ever set your mind to you just have to be able to let your mind run free and seek the sources that make you the happiest uh i i dropped a card okay one moment oh good grief okay so it was two cards so we have the knave of cups and we also have the temperance card here so the Knave of Cups is just bringing you messages from your inner child, okay? So kids really know no bounds when it comes to imagination. They're, they just soar in the things that they think about. They have these wild fantasies. And then somewhere along the line, temperance comes in. You know, we have to adult at some point in life. And we don't realize as we're growing up the freedom that we actually have. And then all these responsibilities kick in whenever you have to start working and supporting a family and take care of things and maintain this facade and structure. Okay, so this card here with your imagination, uh, sorry, dreaming, is asking you to go back and get in touch with your dreams, okay? Like when did you stop giving up on when did you stop formulating a plan based on your dreams as opposed to form formulating a plan based on your current reality which is maybe a nine to five or you're retired and making ends meet and paycheck to paycheck and getting you know the the lawn cut like all these practical matters okay and they can really overcrowd allowing room for your imagination and your intuition to blossom okay so where is your time for do for doing that where is your childlike sense of wonder as you step out into the world which is not always easy okay so you're being asked to really think deeply about stuff like that angel number 333 just went by imagination and intuition okay your gut is your higher self talking to you your imagination will help you build an empire in your mind that will imprint itself on the universe to be realized at some point in your life and sometimes it will take longer than others so again patience is always key in the waiting room of manifestation you guys okay so i'll just pull one more tattoo tarot ink and intuition you can see that everything that you put your mind to is going to pay off for you the nine of pentacles is sort of that reward for staying true to yourself um staying true to your dreams your imagination trusting your intuition you could be feeling some sort of an invitation to do something that you you always wanted to do, but now's the time and it could feel a little bit reckless, but if you've got that burning fire in the pit of your belly to do something, you absolutely owe it to yourself to follow that dream and see where it takes you. Okay, so that's all I'm getting for this reading. So I am going to let you guys go and I'll see you back here tomorrow. Okay, so take care. Bye.